Hi what's up everyone, in this video we are going to talk about the top best microphones for voiceovers you can buy on Amazon. If you are new to this channel please consider subscribing to our channel and press the bell icon. Finding a microphone that will add confidence to your recording and showcase your talent can be difficult. There are several different types of voiceover microphones on the market, and everybody has an opinion on which ones are the best. The question of which microphones are best for recording voiceover performances, on the other hand, comes up frequently. This list is based on my personal opinion and research and lists them based on quality features and pricing. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned be sure to check the links in the description below. So let's get started. On number 5 colon road NT-USB. The NT-USB is a high-quality USB microphone that can be used to record a wide range of vocals. This model includes a 3.5mm headphone jack with zero latency for control and a high-quality pop filter to remove plosives. For voiceovers Anther Rode NT-USB is ideal. It includes a tripod, ring mount, and a storage bag. Beginners and audio professionals on a budget will appreciate this choice. On number 4 colon Electro Voice RE20. Audio engineers and music producers all over the world use the RE20 Dynamic Cardioid Mic, which is considered an industry norm. It has a heavy-duty internal pop filter that works well for close-in voice recordings, as well as a noise reduction internal shock mount. This mic has a great low-end response. Bass tones at 45 Hz add a lot of depth, character, and strength to a vocal take, and the RE20 takes advantage of this. Electro Variable D Voices technology eliminates proximity noise, resulting in a cleaner recording without the need for extensive post-production. I tested this mic in both studio and noisy settings, and the Variable D technology made a noticeable difference in maintaining the emphasis on my voice each time. The RE20 includes a large diaphragm and bass roll-off control for superior sculpting of vocal characteristics. These two features made it easy to get professional results in my studio at home as well as in a professional vocal booth. On number 3 colon Sennheiser MKH416P48G3. The Sennheiser mic is known as the gold standard in technical studios. The Sennheiser is a classic directional shotgun mic that's perfect for road trips and outdoor recordings. It's rugged, lightweight, and easy to use. It has feedback suppression and provides excellent sound quality and ease of use. Do you see it as a part of your home studio equipment for recording your voice? It has never been simpler. The Sennheiser MKH416P48U3 is excellent at capturing clear vocals on set while still recording natural ambience. This makes it an essential piece of gear when you need a mic for vocal work in a crowd. During testing, I found that this mic rejects feedback for clear audio and monitoring environments. I didn't run into any problems, even when I had monitors nearby, and I didn't notice any feedback in post-production. I really appreciate the Sennheiser MKH416P48U3's high directivity, which allows me to catch the correct audio source. When the scene shifted, all I had to do was reposition the mic and I could easily target the right vocal performer without compromising sound quality. On number 2, Rode NTK. The Rode NTK is a big diaphragm condenser with a great warm sound for those who like it very loud. The mic's wide dynamic range and reliability have also been praised by users. It, like other tube microphones, needs to be warmed up before it works at its best. Before recording an audio lecture, make sure it's turned on and on standby for at least 20 or 30 minutes. The Rode NTK features valve circuitry, adding warmth to vocals and instruments alike. During testing, I really liked how even in a vocal booth, my voice came across with an analog tape quality reminiscent of the classic mics of the 1960s. When it came to frequency response research, I was pleasantly surprised to discover that, despite focusing on warm tones in general, the Rode NTK delivered on the company's promise of full spectrum frequency response. This mic includes the addition of a gold plated one diaphragm, and this combines well with the Class A circuitry and graded 6922 twin triad valve to improve performance in terms of sound reproduction. On number 1, Rode Procaster. For YouTube videos, lengthy narrations, and audiobook recordings, the Procaster is ideal. This model offers a tight polar pattern and tailored frequency response. It's a robust voiceover mic with excellent noise reduction. The high output dynamic capsule ensures its top qualities as a broadcast and voiceover microphone. Comes with a built in pop filter to minimize plosives. The Rode Procaster's frequency response has been fine tuned to maximize the range of the human voice. Rode went to great lengths to find the right roll-off frequencies, which I found during research. After 75 Hz, the bottom end drops down, and the top end peaks at 18 kHz. Although suited best for voiceover work, I tried this mic on some instrumental recordings and was satisfied with the results. 
It makes for an excellent room mic, but I was also able to get good results on guitar and bass cabinets. The low impedance quality of this mic monitors character and provides placement options, making it an important piece of recording gear for voiceover artists who need to record in various locations during a project. So guys this was the video about the best microphones for voiceovers. Dot all the links are given in the description, do check them out. If you enjoyed the video be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos. Thank you.